all right so good morning good afternoon everybody how are you doing today i hope you all are doing beautiful okay i greet you depending on your beautiful location if you are in south africa london england australia Amsterdam, any part of the country where you are watching i see god bless everybody all right so uh, a very big congratulation to our popular Hollywood actress ruby ojako you know uh, god just gave her a brand new car you understand so it has been an amazing day for her you understand so imagine when somebody gave out her car you know you understand expecting that another one will come now definitely it has finally come you understand so i think i tend to talk about this uh, lady ruby ojako she has been an amazing person to people out there she has been a blessing to everybody out there you understand if you have been following her up in her instagram you find out that ruby ojako is a very philanthropist lady you know you understand so she has been helping a lot of people out there even when she doesn't have much you understand so <clears throat> I've known her for some certain years now, even way back in Nyko Hotel, you know, we are together then, you know, trying to, you know, hustle together, you understand? So, if you should ask me about Rubio Jack, I'll tell you that Rubio Jack is a, is a perfect example of people out there, you understand? So, even when she doesn't have, she'll try as much as possible to give to people out there, you understand? That is the definition of giving. Yeah, that is a particular post that I made on my Facebook. I talked about, you know, it's not rich people that help people. It's the people that help is, is, is good people. You understand? We have been hearing about rich people, rich people, you understand? We, we are thinking that they are the people that will help the poor. No. You can be rich, but you don't have the spirit of giving. You understand? So, what I'm trying to say is that Rubio Jacob is a perfect example to people out there. You understand? For those of you who have been following her up, so let's just join our hand and celebrate her. It is not easy. God has given her a brand new car. For so many years, she has been driving one particular car, you know, taking her, you know, daughter to school with KK and all that. You know, being a celebrity, everybody would like to feel her more. Everybody would like to, you know, you know follow the lead you understand so but well, she thought it wise that instead of her to start living a fake life you know it, it is good for her to come out openly to let the world knows that she doesn't have a car that i can there are some certain people out there especially celebrity who doesn't have car but they will pretend as if you know they have it all you know living a fake life on social media you understand so but I've seen Rubio Jaka as someone who does not want to live a fake life. That's why the day that she gave out her car to her only brother, you know, she announced it on her Instagram that she's giving out this car and she doesn't have anyone. And she's expecting no car, that God is going to give her a no car. So, you know, I said to my mind that this girl, since she can give out her car to someone, I mean, God is about to bless and it is happening now. You understand? We know the first car she has been driving, I think is a Land Rover, black and all that. So ever since then she has been trekking, taking her daughter to school with KK and all that. So and a lot of people have been praying for her to have a look and I think the prayer has now been answered. So as you can see this is the picture of the car, the brand new car. You know, is amazing, you understand. So we have two different content in this video and another one is uh, our popular uh, hip-hop artist davido and his baby mama uh, sophia mahmoud you understand we all know that i've made a video concerning this particular issue you understand where davido took mahmoud to court you know she's he's seeking for custody of the daughter you understand which uh, sophia has been denying him you understand so and the matter still in the court even uh, before the wedding that was when they started the issue in the court so even a lot of people have been attacking the video why would you take her to court now that you want to do your wedding why not wait until after your wedding you understand so a lot of things have been said about the video and uh, you know sophia so now i think i going to what i heard which i'm not sure i've not really confirmed whether it is true that the video have lost the case in 
the law courts, you understand? They have been denying him of custody of his son because of some certain issues. Because he refused to, you know, he did not take care of his son, and that's why they lost a family, you understand? So, in a lot of things have been said, which we don't even know the truth until we hear from the video directly or Sophia. You understand what I'm saying? But this should be a lesson to everybody out there, you understand? You know, you should be very careful the way you treat people, you understand? So, you know, I, you know, I couldn't tell what I heard that the video refused to be paying her school fees and all that. Even the last news I heard, they said the father was the one that paid up all Sophia's bills, the school fees and her studying base and all that. So it was the video father that paid off. So, and according to Sophia, she said, I don't know, Shabo, she did not do a video of this. It's just what I've been hearing. You know, when something happened, you start hearing a lot of stories and all that. That the video only want to be sleeping with her without paying or taking care of her and all that, which I am not sure. Like I say, we are not sure of this, you understand? So we'll keep our finger crossed. You understand so but what i'm saying is that the 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 the, the issue still in the court they have not given out the final judgment on this issue so my point is that it is a blessing to everyone out there you should be very careful the way you live your life the way you mingle yourself with different women and all that you know it it can result to some dinners you understand so tomorrow now another person will just wake up and say uh the video you are you are not permitted to come close to my son or to my daughter you understand because all these things are happening is trauma might not be happy about it because imagine when you are seeing your husband you know doing some certain case and all that it's, it's heartbroken you understand so you try as much as possible as a man to live a very responsible life you understand so no matter who you are no matter how famous you think you are yeah, no matter how you think women are roaming around you and all that, you have the spirit of to control yourself. You understand? So I'm not trying to blame David. I'm not trying to blame anybody. But this should be a lesson to everybody out there. You understand? So please, I would like you all to drop your comment. Congratulations once again to our popular Nollywood actress Ruby Ojako as God has given her a new car. It is not easy. So. Congratulations to you, God continues. In fact, your blessings are yet to come. This is just the beginning. Alright, please, if you love her, drop your comment and also pray for her for more blessings. And what do you think about this David issue and Sophia? Do you think Sophia should give David access to come close to his daughter? You know, that is that is his blood, is the real father. You can't change that no matter what has transferred, you can't change the fact that stay his father you understand so and i think sophia should have a rethink and even though the video has not been good or as he as he said you understand so i don't know no matter what has happened i think she should consider him as his father even when the child will grow she will still ask for his father you cannot change that fact you understand so i think that's what she's supposed to do all right this is my own opinion and i would like you also to drop your own opinion all right thank you and God bless you. Please drop your comments.